Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a sold-out show here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. I'm Michael Cole here with Taz at ringside. Man, you couldn't fit another fan in here with a crowbar, I'm telling you. There's a whole lot of cheese heads in the house tonight. It sure is. Green Bay knows that they're about to see the greatest superstars in all of sports entertainment. I can't wait to get started. There's the reversal, Cole. Man, his opponent looked like a punk with that counter. These superstars have been going hard all match. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're going to win a match if you're out of gas two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. You saw that one coming. There is no doubt that Batista made a hell of an impact on Raw, Cole. But now that he doesn't have Triple H or Ric Flair watching his back, I think his days might be numbered. Batista has taken the best of his former Evolution teammates and having Raw over and he's always come out on top. I don't think that's going to change. This has been a great match so far, and I think it's pretty obvious which way it's going. Oh, really? Are you willing to go out on a limb and actually make a guess then? There's no guesswork involved, Cole, but if you're gonna be snippy, I'm just gonna keep my mouth shut. <laughs> wow, if I knew it was that easy, I would have said that years ago. It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, any time you throw these kind of combustible elements into a match, you're guaranteed to get a hell of a show. And that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. I love hearing the crowd come alive, even when I don't exactly agree with what they're saying. Me too. And I do agree with what they're saying, Taz. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Paul. I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in that. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up the win. Guys, you're talking about two different things. Going outside the rules in the name of self-defense is one thing. But cheating to steal a victory and enhance your own career is something completely different. Man, I'm telling you, from my great experience, trust me, you could cut this tension with a knife. I don't think you need in-ring experience to feel the tenacity radiating off these superstars task. I don't think anything could be more obvious. Spoken like a guy who's never been in that bowl, trust me. When it comes down to you or them, it's a whole different level of intensity. I'll have to take your word for it, Taz. I honestly can't imagine a more electric atmosphere than the one in this arena right now. I gotta tell you, Cole, I thought I had this thing figured out, but now I got no idea how this is gonna end up. Neither do I, Taz. And I think it's that unpredictability that makes it so exciting. No doubt, Cole. I've seen superstars get a huge advantage over their opponents and still lose the match because they got sloppy. Anything can happen in WWE. An entire match can turn on one or two big moves. And that's why you can't take your eyes off the action for one second. You never know when something huge is going to go down. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. No surprise there, Cole. The WWE fans ain't exactly known for keeping their opinions to themselves. You talk about raw power. You talk about intensity. Have you ever seen a superstar like Batista? Hey, there's no doubt he's a very impressive dude, no question. But let's not get too carried away here. It's not like he's the biggest and baddest guy ever to step foot in a WWE ring, Cole. You know what I mean? You say that, Taz. But no one else comes to mind. 
You've got to be pretty big and pretty bad to pin Triple H for the World Heavyweight title. And that's exactly what Batista did at WrestleMania 21. Hey, look. Submission hold locked in. We may see a tap out right here. And even if you can't make your opponent tap out, this will take a lot of fight out of him. Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. Oh, come on, Cole. You know, this look, looks like he's taking his opponent for a ride. Oh, God. What a huge Batista bomb. Hey, no one has to take twice. He's going for the cover, Cole. There's the cover. Wow, talk about cutting it close. That was almost free. This capacity crowd is on its feet. It knows what's coming. Here it comes. Batista bomb. That'll break every bone in your body, Cole. It sounds like this capacity crowd is... There's the pin. Can his opponent One, kick out? Two, three. Here's your winner. Batista. Batista.